bum 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 the Peter Dislike Show. Bum 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 bum. I was just watching an episode of the Dave Ramsey Show. He had a caller call in bragging about how he had bought a rental property and that he was already up forty thousand dollars. And Dave Ramsey corrected him and said that you're not up forty thousand until you sell it. I actually disagree with that statement. See, if he sells that house and gets forty thousand extra U.S. dollars, paper money, he can't buy forty thousand more house for it, right? Because all the neighboring houses would have gone up equally, right? So let me give you another analogy. When I make bismuth art and I make one of those large Buddhas which has about six pounds of bismuth and I go to an art show and I sell it for two or three times what I spent on it, right? Sometimes less, but uh, I think my best was more like five times. I really don't feel I've profited anything until, until I buy back even more bismuth uh, with the proceeds of that, right? Because if I don't, bismuth prices could go up, right? Uh, my goal is to multiply my bismuth stack and maybe improve my lifestyle as I, as I do that as well. But by and large, my goal is to expand my holding of bismuth, right? So um, going back to that real estate analogy, I would say the caller hasn't really profited until he can take that house and turn it into two houses or to at least take some of the proceeds and expand the house in some way, right? Add a few bedrooms, right? Then he has actually profited, right? 